Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into a profound and urgent topic that resonates deeply with Christians around the world. The belief that Jesus is coming soon is a cornerstone of Christian faith, and today we're going to explore 13 powerful scriptures that underscore this belief and what they mean for us in our daily lives. So, let's get ready to delve into these profound biblical passages. First up, let's look at Revelation chapter 22 verse 12-13. Look, I am coming soon. My reward is with me, and I will give to each person according to what they have done. I am the Alpha and the Omega, the first and the last, the beginning and the end. This scripture is a powerful reminder that Jesus' return is imminent and that he will bring justice and rewards. It's a call to live righteously, knowing that our actions have eternal significance. Next, consider Matthew chapter 24 verse 36. But about that day or hour no one knows, not even the angels in heaven, nor the Son, but only the Father. This verse highlights the unpredictability of Jesus' return. It's a reminder to stay vigilant and prepared, living each day as though it could be the day of his return. In 1 Thessalonians chapter 5, 2, 3, Paul writes, For you know very well that the day of the Lord will come like a thief in the night. While people are saying, Peace and safety, destruction will come on them suddenly, as labor pains on a pregnant woman, and they will not escape. Here, we see the suddenness and unexpected nature of Jesus' return, urging us to remain spiritually awake and alert. Let's look at John chapter 14 verse 3. Jesus promises, And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come back and take you to be with me that you also may be where I am. This scripture is a beautiful assurance that Jesus is preparing a place for us in his kingdom, reinforcing the hope and anticipation of his return. Hebrews chapter 9 verse 28 states, So Christ was sacrificed once to take away the sins of many, and he will appear a second time, not to bear sin, but to bring salvation to those who are waiting for him. This verse underscores the purpose of Jesus' second coming, to bring salvation to those who eagerly await him. It's a call to faith and perseverance. Now, let's turn to Luke chapter 21 verse 25-28. There will be signs in the sun, moon, and stars. On the earth, nations will be in anguish and perplexity at the roaring and tossing of the sea. People will faint from terror, apprehensive of what is coming on the world, for the heavenly bodies will be shaken. At that time they will see the Son of Man coming in a cloud with power and great glory. When these things begin to take place, stand up and lift up your heads, because your redemption is drawing near. This passage describes the cosmic signs preceding Jesus' return and encourages us to look up with hope, knowing our redemption is near. Revelation chapter 1 verse 7 proclaims, Look, he is coming with the clouds, and every eye will see him, even those who pierced him, and all peoples on earth will mourn because of him. So shall it be. Amen. This verse emphasizes the universal visibility and impact of Jesus' return a moment that will be witnessed by all humanity. Moving to Philippians chapter 3 verse 20 21, Paul writes, But our citizenship is in heaven. And we eagerly await a Savior from there, the Lord Jesus Christ, who, by the power that enables him to bring everything under his control, will transform our lowly bodies so that they will be like his glorious body. This scripture encourages us to remember our heavenly citizenship and the glorious transformation that awaits us. In Mark chapter 13 verse 32-33, Jesus says, But about that day or hour no one knows, not even the angels in heaven, nor the Son, but only the Father. Be on guard. Be alert. You do not know when that time will come. Once again, we are reminded to be on constant watch, living in a state of readiness for his return. 1 Peter chapter 4 verse 7 tells us, The end of all things is near. Therefore be alert and of sober mind so that you may pray. This verse emphasizes the importance of prayer and mental clarity as we approach the end times, underscoring the need for spiritual discipline and vigilance. James chapter 5 verse 8 encourages us, You too, be patient and stand firm, because the Lord's coming is near. Patience and steadfastness are key virtues as we await Jesus' return reminding us to remain strong in our faith despite challenges. Titus chapter 2 verse 13 offers us hope. 
while we wait for the blessed hope, the appearing of the glory of our great God and Savior, Jesus Christ. This scripture speaks to the hope and joy we find in the anticipation of Jesus' return, a source of comfort and strength. Lastly, let's reflect on Matthew chapter 24 verse 44. So you also must be ready, because the Son of Man will come at an hour when you do not expect Him. This final verse reinforces the call to readiness, living each day with the awareness that Jesus could return at any moment. These 13 scriptures collectively remind us of the importance of living a life of faith, vigilance, and readiness for Jesus' imminent return. They encourage us to stay spiritually alert, to live righteously, and to hold on to the hope of our salvation. Thank you for watching and joining me in this exploration of these profound biblical truths. If you found this video meaningful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with others, and subscribe for more inspirational content. Let's live each day in anticipation of his return. God bless.